A commercial bank is a financial institution that grants loans to its customers. It's able to lend money by accepting deposits from other customers that it lends out to these clients. Let's take a look at how a bank makes money. It gets funds from its customers and pays them a portion of interest on those funds. It then lends out funds to other customers and charges them a rate of interest. The spread between the amount that it pays the deposit customers and the amount that it charges the borrowing customers is the spread and the money that it makes, which is called interest income. This is the main way banks make money. They also charge fees such as convenience fees or transaction fees that allow them to earn money as well. Let's look at the main functions that a commercial bank provides. They accept deposits in the form of saving accounts, current accounts, or term deposits. That means they take money from the customers that want to store it and earn some interest. Commercial banks create credit facilities, which are short-term and medium-term loans that customers can use the money to then invest in for other purposes. They have credit creation, which arises from deposit accounts, which borrowers can draw funds from. And they also serve important agency functions for their customers, which includes things like paying checks and dividends, as well as insurance and trading accounts for investments and other securities. Let's look at the type of loans offered by commercial banks. There's a standard bank loan where the amount of money offered by a bank to the borrower has a defined interest rate and a fixed period of time. There's cash credit where the bank lends a client money to go beyond their account limit. There's a bank overdraft where the client can actually extend for a certain period of time beyond the limit of their account. Finally, credit cards are a form of spending where customers can purchase goods or services and pay for them later with the actual cash in their accounts. Commercial banks are regulated by central banks and other government organizations that require the commercial banks to operate within certain rules and limits. This includes capital reserves that help the bank prevent insolvency or bank runs, which means they would run out of cash and not be able to pay back their customers. In summary, the main function of a commercial bank is to accept deposits and lend money out to individuals and companies that need that cash to grow the economy. Thank you for joining us for this quick tutorial on commercial banks.